On the diamond, they had to wait through an hour and a half rain delay, but it was Princess Night at the Tin Caps. And if it was Princess Night, it means Joey Cantillo was your Prince Charming. Top of the first, Cantillo gets the strikeout. He had six Ks in six innings, gave up just one run. Bottom of the second, the Caps get on the board. Chopper here by Ethan Skender over the third baseman's head. Blake Hunt in, Justin Lopez in. Caps build a three-zip lead. Top of the third, Cantilla would induce the 5-4-3 double play. Caps, they win it. 5-1, Ryan Weathers will start tomorrow's game for the Tin Caps. He and Cantillo giving Fort Wayne maybe the best one-two combo in the Midwest League. I know it's a lot of fun. Uh, what Joey's doing right now, what he's done since the second half started and into the first half, I mean, it's impressive. It's some of the best in minor league baseball. And, uh, you know, just taking some of his work ethic, I mean, there's not a guy in the clubhouse that works harder than him for what he's, for what he's earned. And uh, last start, uh, he was up to 91 to 94. And, I mean, that's huge for him. Uh, wish I could learn his changeup. He has longer, he has bigger hands than me, so I can't throw his changeup. But, uh, no, it's just been a lot of fun, you know, just working with him day in, day out. Tin Caps open a four-game series at the Great Lakes Loons tomorrow night.